Yeah, yeah, that's that money talk. That's that money talk. Got a lot of fans, a lot of haters, we just let them talk. Cause they'll never face us to the paper, we just talking about the earth, we're really shaking with this craters that we throwing out, yeah. So, no, you got titty freedom, block his number, what is up you guys, it's your boy T-Rust back with another video and today we are talking about the Dallas Cowboys so if you're down with that make sure you <laughs> smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications because you know like keep that night gang strong, let's get right into it. So, as we know recently the Cowboys have been making moves with their coaching staff. We basically have an entirely new coaching staff with Mike, McCar Mike McCarthy as our head coach, Mike Nolan as our defensive coordinator and the only common denominator from last um, coaching staff to this one is Kellen Moore who is our offensive coordinator still and um, also we've discussed you know moving our offense to a west coast um, scheme so you know we've done a lot over you know the period of time since Jason Garrett's been fired okay we've done a lot but that's not really what I came to talk about I can talk about Des Bryant, okay? And Des Bryant really wants to come to the Cowboys. And he's been wanting to come back to the Cowboys since he's been released, basically. Since, um, since we've needed a court, uh, a re wide receiver, you remember that time before we had Amari Cooper? Since we needed a wide receiver, Des Bryant's been wanting to come back. And honestly, I'm all for it. I want Des Bryant back, too. And I've wanted him since we need a receiver, too. I'm like, why not? We need a receiver. Go get him. And, you know, at this time, we don't need a receiver, but it would be great to have Des Bryant. Like, um, you know, a few days, like yesterday, he was like, give me the role they gave Witten. No shot at Witten. Let me play with Zeke, Pollard, Gallup, Cooper, Cobb, Jarwin. Think about it. In the meantime, I'm working. And, you know, that means, you know, we don't, we don't got to pay Des Bryant all that money. He just wants to come play with the boys. He just wants to come play with these young boys. And he wants to, um, he wants to polish their skill. And last year, where we struggled? We struggled in the red zone as an offense. We struggled in the red zone as an offense. And to have a target like Des Bryant, that's Des Bryant's specialty. Des Bryant in the red zone, I would love it. I would love it, and for him to come and have a mentor role for Amari Cooper and Michael Gallup, that we he can make them bear red zone threats as well. Make Blake Jarwin a bear red zone threat. Okay? If we have some guys who can go get that ball, do you know how much easier it would make the offense in the red zone? Like, it would make it so much easier. And then you got Zeke. So, like, it's almost impossible to stop us. It's almost impossible to stop us. So, I really want Des back, and if if Jerry Jones could get that done, it would be a huge lift for this team, and I know that, and I know we got, we're working with a lot of our contracts right now, we have a lot of free agents right now, including Dak and Amari, who gotta get paid, okay, you know, Dak maybe can take a franchise tag, maybe, but those two guys gotta get paid, and then we got Robert Quinn, who had... The most sacks on our team. We have Randall Cobb, who had a beautiful season last year. Um, I believe Sean Lee still needs another contract. Um, so, you know, Byron Jones. We have a lot of guys to pet. And, you know, I know we got to focus on that, but I like the idea of having Des Bryant on this team with this young core group of guys. And then also, Des Bryant, he's going to bring the emotion back to this team. There's a lot of teams where I was just like, where we were losing, or even when we're winning, it's like, there's no emotion on that sideline, especially when we're losing. There's no emotion. Everybody's just quiet. There's nobody there. Nobody's talking to each other. They're all just sitting there, quiet. You know, Des Bryant, when he was on this team, he was in your face. And, you know, I've preached that a lot, you know. I want, I want, I want us to be in each other's faces when we're not doing what we're supposed to be. We can't be sitting alone. You know, we got to discuss with each other what's going on. Why is why is nothing working? You know what I'm saying? You know, we can't just look and say, okay, I did this wrong. Oh, but he did this wrong too. You guys got to discuss that with each other. And let each other know, like, yo, you need to step up. 
And that's what Des Bryant did when he was with this team. And, you know, it was it was to the point where he was doing this so much that people thought he was complaining on the sideline. And, you know, that wasn't it. It was just he's so emotional about winning and losing. He don't like to lose that you saw it. You saw it on that sideline that he don't like to lose. And that's what I want on that sideline. That's what I want to see. Some passion. I didn't see any passion from any of my guys last year. None. We, we heard about Michael Bennett. Oh, we got to re-sign Michael Bennett as well. I like him too. But we heard about Michael Bennett um, yelling in the locker room after a game. Um, after the game against the um, the Bears, I think. Um, and, you know, that he was yelling in the locker room. And, you know, it didn't do much. It didn't motivate anybody. And it was like, you know, Michael Bennett just got here. What does he know? You know, he's been he's been eight and zero the whole season. What does he know about being in this situation? All right. And so I just think I think having Des Bryant, adding Des Bryant to his team would be a plus for this for this Cowboys team. I think it will, and I think Jerry Jones needs to consider um signing him. I would love to have Des Bryant back. I would love to see this. I would love to see this back. Um. You know, he, and I think he's ready. You know, he's been working all off season since he tore his Achilles, uh, what, a year ago? He's been working. And we need to hop on the opportunity to get him before anybody else does. Because honestly, I really want Des Bryant. Adding another weapon to this team does not hurt anybody. Doesn't hurt anybody. You know, we could use another weapon. Because honestly, last, this season, you know, it was sometimes where I'm like, why is nobody getting open? You know, maybe it was the route combos that were being used. But I'm like, why is nobody getting open? And so, another weapon, another weapon, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind it. I would love it. If that person is Des Bryant, I would love it. You know? So, uh, that's it for this video. If you like to make sure you... Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, keep not like, keep that name game strong, comment, share with everybody you know, and I'll see you for another one, so, peace. This is for them shotties with them dollars, this is for them shotties that don't need a baller, and we gon' make it to the top, that's on my mama, money machine counting all this guala, this is